Like, I mean, it kind of sucks, but if I feel like my life is more of a job than my job. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like my job is my zen. When I tattoo is the time that I have a break, is the time that I relax. And I'm talking about my body and my I mean, it's just an indescribable feeling. My name is Nam, uh, I work at Mr. Tattoos, exactly. Yes, like I feel humble, meaning like, you know, I, I feel like it's an honor for me. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's my privilege to tattoo my customers. That's why, dude, you get asked all my customers, like, I love my customers. And I mean, I hope they feel the same way for me too, you know what I'm talking about? But to me, my customers are really important because they trust me, bro. Like, they trust me more than, than anybody else. Like, even their doctor, you know what I mean? Like, that's pretty much what I am to them. Like, the family doctor. Like they, they trust me enough to come here to like to like refer me to other people and their family. You know what I'm talking about? This is permanent. Like I'm altering people's images permanently, and they trust me. Well, like not a lot of people understand. Like it's it's me and my client. It's never just me. It's never just my client. Or else, you know what I mean? We won't have the relationship that we do because if we work together so hard. It's, to me, it's it's a personal thing. You know what I'm talking about? Like it's personal for me to tattoo my client. It's personal for me to do this piece on them. You know what I'm talking about? Like, it's not just money. It's not just business. It's not just them bringing something in and that's it. You know what I mean? Like, to me, that's that's just a walking. That, that's just somebody that, you know what I mean? Getting a small tattoo or something like that. But if it's somebody that, like, really is in love with a tattoo, like me, you know what I mean? Like, we'll, we could create magic, you know what I mean? Too. I hear the machine when I sleep, I smell the grief, so when I wake up, it's the truth. That's just embedded into me, man. To me, it's to me it smells like summer, but to other people it probably smells like pain. And agony. <laughs> yeah, the first time I picked up a needle was like about five years ago. And it was just like me tattooing my buddy and it was just <laughs> it was like it was like an outline. I was supposed to take me like 20 minutes. It took me like six hours. Man, that guy took it though, man. I, I would I would like to keep tattooing the way it is, bro. Like the way it was, just traditional. You know what I'm talking about? Like all the stuff that's going on now, man. Tattoo is my life, yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't think people see it the way I see it. Like, I live it. I breathe it. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's me. Like, when, when you say tattoo, I just think of me. 